Hi, my name is Eric Stinson from Juniper's product marketing team. And today we are continuing with our series of question of the days regarding uh, EVPN and uh, host router bridging or HRB. So uh, with me, I'm joined by Wen Lin, uh, one of Juniper's distinguished engineers. Hi, Wen. Hi, Eric. Uh, thank you for joining me. Um, and today, you know, the last question of the day, we talked a little bit about, you know, where we are with the EVPN and the data center. Um, but, it, and you kind of mentioned host router bridging. So today what we'd like to do is dig a little further into that. And what exactly is host router bridging or HRB? EVPN host router bridging use a cloud native approach to build the EVPN data centers. It can provide a scale out solutions with consistency, operational simplicity, and at the same time, increase your revenue growth. So compared to a traditional EVPN data center, where the intelligence of uh, EVPN to build overlay network resides on the leaf device for east-west data center traffic in the cross fabric, now we move the intelligence of EVPN to establish virtualized overlay network from the leaf device down to the end station, which connect directly to the cross fabric. And all the protocol that is used to discover and establish EVPN over a tunnel right now running on the device and the device, which is the host can be host or server or bare metal itself. With HRB, the East-West traffic now travel from the host directly over the overlay tunnel to another host. And the spine leaf data center cross fabric become a real only the IP transport. They are not aware of the overlay network. They become the pure IP transport for the EVPN running on the host. Most routed bridging today with provide EVPN multi-tenancy and EVPN VDN aware and a VDN based service. Well, thank you, Wen. That was, uh, that sounds pretty cool. So it sounds like HRB is going to have a lot of advantages and I look forward to continuing with this series as we move and, and hear what some of those advantages are as well as, you know, how Juniper is implementing uh, HRB. So thank you very much. Thank you, Eric.